What's up you guys and welcome back to a brand new episode of Chemical Guys Detail Garage. On today's video we have something brand new. That's right, it's right here in front of me. It's our newest Torque Big Mouth Max Release Foam Cannon. Check that out you guys. This thing is massive. We've completely redesigned our foam cannon and we went with an all brand new design fully restructured from A to Z, making sure that we paid attention to all the things that you guys all know and love about foam cannons and making it better. Check this thing out, you guys. It's right here in front of me. This thing is epic. I mean, just from the design, it looks awesome. You guys can see it has a fresh, brand new look and it's built a lot bigger and better so that you get the best foam out there. Let's take a closer look at this foam cannon. So I'm gonna pick it up and show you guys just how big it compares to my hand. As you guys can see, this thing is massive. It's a 34 ounce bottle. It's our biggest bottle yet, and you can fill it up with more of your favorite Chemical Guy soap so that you guys can foam for a lot longer. It also has these nice little ridges on the back side of it, which allows me to easily grasp it so that it's not tipping over. I'm not dropping it because it's too smooth. It has a nice little indentation in the bottle so that you can easily grab it and move it around. The bottle itself is also pre-labeled with measuring marks to make it easier for you to be able to measure how much soap and how much water you apply into your bottle. We've also manufactured this bottle to have a lot bigger of a mouth, which means that I can take off my nozzle right here and you guys can see this thing has a huge mouth, which means it's gonna be a lot easier for you to dilute your soap into your bottle so that you don't have any kind of accidental spills trying to you know, pour it into a smaller neck. One of the other biggest things that we paid attention to was the actual nozzle connection to the bottle itself. It's gonna be a lot easier for you to go ahead and twist it on and take it off. So I can easily grab it, twist it on, tighten it, and I have full access to it so that I can easily take it on and off as much as I'd like. Moving forward, it does utilize the same quarter inch quick connect so that you can easily connect it to your Torx Snubby pressure washer gun attachment and or any kind of pressure washer gun that utilizes a quarter inch quick connect. The Torx Big Mouth Max Release Foam Cannon works with either gas and or electric pressure washers. We've also made the breather valve much larger, which means that it's gonna go ahead and pull in much more air to give you that perfect mixture of foam. We've also supersized the nozzle on top right here with our new full flow technology, which allows you to easily change the settings of your foam cannon to achieve the thickest of suds or wash that lightly dusty garage queen. You can turn it down a bit and achieve a more sudsy wash versus if you want more of a thick shaving cream like suds, you can twist it all the way clockwise to ensure that you get the best foam possible. So just to kind of reiterate about the dial on top with our full flow technology, this dial allows you to control the level of soap that you want to go ahead and shoot. So whether you have a super filthy car, you may want to go ahead and turn that all the way clockwise so that you achieve the thickest suds around, or maybe you're cleaning your lightly dusty garage queen. You can turn this and kind of mess with it a little bit and kind of figure out which foam settings you like best. You can turn it open a little bit to allow a little bit more water through, which is going to give you more of a sudsy kind of wash. And finally, we get to our nozzle. Now this nozzle, it's massive. It has a two inch diameter, which means it's a lot thicker. It's our biggest head yet. We've also designed this foam cannon with the all new big blow bezel, which shapes the air and foam exiting the nozzle, helping direct it into an ultra wide stream of the thickest, whitest, and fluffiest foam you have ever seen. And one last thing about this foam cannon is the fan. Now this fan is very, very wide. So you can go ahead and twist your nozzle right here, which allows you to change the shape of the fan. So whether you wanna cover it the largest of trucks, such as trucks, SUVs, RVs, boats, and you wanna get the widest angle possible, go ahead and turn that all the way closed so that you shoot the widest angle possible. You can also twist your nozzle to have more of a smaller fan, or open it up all the way to shoot in a direct stream. And that stream helps you get into those hard to reach places such as your undercarriage, wheel wells, and all those hard to reach places all over your ride. You can also use your Torque Big Mouth Max Release Foam Cannon for home applications as well. So if you wanna go ahead and foam up your garage doors, fences, walls, this thing works out great for household applications as well. All right guys, so enough with the technical talk. Let me show you guys how it works. So right here, right next to us, we have this humongous F-150 truck. This thing is massive, which means that we're gonna need a massive foam cannon to take it on, such as the Big Mouth Max Release. Now, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna set up my two bucket method because I wanna make sure that I get that nice two bucket method wash going on to prevent the chance of scratches and swirls during my wash. So I have my two dirt traps right here. I'm gonna go ahead and set these into my buckets right here. 
set them down at an angle, and then you want to lay them down flat towards the bottom, and they create a nice suction so that they stay nice and down there and they don't move at all. So now that that's set up, now it's time to set up our foam cannon. So I'm gonna open up the nozzle right here on our big mouth, take it off. It's already pre-filled with water. I'm gonna actually dump out a little bit and I'm gonna go ahead and put some soap in it. And the soap that we're gonna be using today is gonna to be our honeydew snow foam. Now, one of my personal favorite things about the bottle of this foam cannon is that it's clear, which means that you get to see the soap that you have inside of it, and it makes it look super cool when you're foaming your ride. So check this out. I'm gonna put about two ounces of honeydew snow foam. One, two. Check that out. It looks really cool. It looks like something that belongs in a laboratory. <laughs> I'm gonna close this up right now. And you guys can see that hex pattern right there. It definitely helps you out with screwing it on so that you don't have any kind of hard time screwing it on and it has a nice snug fit. Check that out, right guys? So now that that's set up, all I'm gonna do is stir my foam cannon here and check that out, you guys. See how cool the foam look, the soap looks in there? It looks really awesome and you know, it pairs well with your favorite Chemical Guys soap. So now that that's set up, I'm gonna set down my Big Mouth Max Release Foam Cannon. I'm gonna grab some honeydew snow foam. I'm gonna dedicate my green dirt trap bucket as my soap bucket and go ahead and put about an ounce of soap in there. So check that out, nice and in there. Gonna grab my wash mitt, gonna dunk that in there as well to kind of pre-saturate with that soap. We're gonna activate our suds during the rinsing process. So right now I'm gonna grab the pressure washer, flick it on, and then I'm gonna give this car a pre-rinse and be back with you guys to show you the awesome specs on this foam cannon. All right guys, so now that we're done rinsing off the truck, now I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to plug in your foam cannon. So like I mentioned, if you have a Torx Snubby and or any kind of pressure washer gun that utilizes a quarter inch quick connect, all you have to do is pull it back, get your foam cannon adapter and just put it in there and then it's good to go. So just like that, it's that easy, it's quick connect, plug it in, you're ready to start foaming. I'm gonna show you guys the two different ways of how to foam your car. So I mentioned at the beginning of the video that you can turn this nozzle to adjust how wide or how straight you want your angle to be. So right now I'm gonna show you guys the straight angle so that you guys can see how I foam up those hard to reach places like the wheel liners, the undercarriage and all that stuff. So stay tuned, we'll be right back. Alright you guys, so you guys saw how easy it is to get into those hard to reach places. Remember, depending on the size and the angle that you want to shoot your foam cannon in, you can adjust this to your liking. So right now, I'm actually going to foam up the entire truck. So I'm going to show you guys the different kind of settings as I'm foaming the truck so that you guys can see how wide or how close you can make the fan on this foam cannon.
right guys and there you guys have it you guys saw we were able to cover and foam up all the areas of this truck whether it be those hard to reach places like the undercarriage or give it a nice clean sweep with a thick rich blanket of foam on the entire truck so now what we're going to do is we're going to give it a nice deep wash using our two bucket wash method i have my microfiber chenille wash mitt here i'm going to use this wash mitt to properly wipe down the truck give it a full cleaning making sure that we're utilizing the two bucket method coming back and forth rinsing our mitt so that we don't install any kind of scratches or swirls to the truck so i'm going to finish up washing the truck rinse it off and i'll be back with you guys with the results Alright guys, and there you guys have it. We just finished rinsing off the truck. You guys saw the amazing type of suds that we achieved using our newest Torque Big Mouth Max Release Foam Cannon. So if you want to achieve that thick, rich suds, make sure to visit our website, chemicalguys.com, or swing by your local detail garage store to pick yours up and get your foam on today. So I'm going to go ahead and finish up drying this truck. As always, my name is Joey, this is Chemical Guys Detail Garage, and I'll see you guys next time. Yeah!